You're not getting anywhere with this von Borschert. You know, I kind of get the same feeling, my dear Sarah. Listen. Nothing. Not a sound. No one's coming to save you. Huh. That's what you think. The Golden Order knows exactly where we are. <laughs> By the time your ridiculous secret society turns up, I'll be long gone. As for you, nothing will remain of your body. If you touch a single hair of my mother's head, I'll skin you alive. You know, Louis, I have no intention of beating your dear mother. There are more persuasive ways of making you talk. You've stolen something from me that I intend to get back. Where have you hidden it? Von Borschert, you can't sell that book on the black market anymore. This is finished. We know you're planning on selling at one of Lord Mortimer's parties. All right? Just tell us who the buyer is and we can make a deal. You've no idea of the trouble you've gotten yourselves into. Oh, but you will tell me where it's hidden. I can promise you that. Oh, stop annoying our host, Louis. Son, didn't what happened to you in Rome teach you anything? Just a few more minutes and my concoction will be ready. With this, your bodies will dissolve in less than four hours. You'll see. It loosens tongues in no time. You know, I have to admit, Mother, the only thing you've ever taught me is that damn motto of yours. Always remain rational. And open. I got it. I've opened our shackles. Draw him over here. I'll take care of him. Von Borchard! Von Borchard! Hmm? Listen! Let's make a deal. I'll tell you where the book is if you let my mother go free. Oh, what are you playing at? Don't worry, mother. You want to play the hero. Pity you're not in any position to do so. For the last time. Where is Alazif? Let me do this. Oh, Trust ah. me. What? Well, here we go. Um, well, we're just gonna we're gonna trust mother to start with. We're just we're gonna, mother, trust mother. Please, be my guest, mother. Yes, be my guest. Mm. Uh. Shoot him. Just pull the trigger. Oh, uh. stabby stab. Uh. <laughs> well done, Louis. You reacted perfectly. How do you feel, Mother? Couldn't be better. He's alive, so I can question him after we get back. Pity he's just a middleman. Hmm. Means I haven't finished with this case. Oh, I had a feeling you'd be running off on one of your adventures again, Mother. You know what? I'm warning you. Mother. This time, I'm coming with you. No. Even though you impress me more and more, I have to do this on my own. Mother, you're no spring chicken anymore. Come on, let's go home. Oh, and don't forget to send nice. our men to tend to Von Borchardt. Okay, do we get to look around? What? Oh, oh no. Read letters from or address to others' guests. Oh, we get to sneak through people's mail. One month later. January 20th, 1793. Olden times. Off the coast of Mary, England. Okay, here we are. This is Beard Skunk. And we are playing this game called Council. Oh, big bad wolf. Look out, look out, look out. Ooh. 
Well done, Mother. Mother. You just had to pick up Bob Burchard's trail on your own, didn't you? You ditch me in Paris with no explanation, and off you go to infiltrate one of the world-renowned receptions of this Lord Mortimer. And now he writes me to say that you've gone missing on his private island, which, by the way, looks more like a big rock than a paradise island. Yeah, like just the, look at there it is, the council. Just episode one, some mad ones. Yeah, okay. <laughs> um. The least he could do is explain to me how he managed to lose you. In any case, it is time for you to stop all this, Mother. It no longer suits your age. Well, I'm sure I'll find you once again, slogging through the caves beneath the island, searching for some long-lost mystical object that you just can't live without. I'm already hating this trip, and all I've done is think about it. Contrary to what one may be able to imagine, it was not the host himself who invited me. Well now, Duchess, we find ourselves oh, both invited safe. by Sir Holm. Well, how very amusing. Perhaps we have some common interests, Your Eminence. Is this your first time at one of Lord Mortimer's legendary parties? Oh, no. We have been friends since long ago. But as I'm doing some business with Sir Holm, the invitation came from him. Well, I simply can't wait for all the festivities to begin. And you, good sir, what brings you here? Uh, uh, he, uh, he sent me a letter? Lord Mortimer asked me to join him. We have some business to take care of. Oh, how mysterious. You adapt quickly, my son. You get along here like a fish in water. Would you believe that we are all here hoping to solve our personal issues? You'll see. Right. I doubt that you came here to look for your mother. <laughs> yeah, it's, yeah, yeah. Anyway, yeah. consider yourself fortunate, young man. Your because there are many who dream of simply one day setting foot on this island. And only a very few ever make it. Indeed, I imagine this must be your first time here. Uh, yep. Yep. Uh, we're gonna do it this way. And you, Duchess? Duchess? You seem to be quite accustomed to things here. Am I right? Well, I do there. not think that one can ever get accustomed to what Lord Mortimer prepares for his guests. But you are right. This is not the first time I've been on this wharf. If you've come back again, I imagine you must find it to be of some interest. Here, everything is possible if you make the right choices. It really is up to you whether you leave better off or not. Please excuse me if you find me overly curious, young man. I did not mean to cause you any embarrassment. Oh, I'm not Come, Duchess. They are waiting for us. We're moving, oh, Monsieur priest, de Richet, if you would like to join us. I'm uh, coming, Duchess. Yeah, yeah. Oh, phrasing. A cardinal? A Duchess? I wonder if all the guests here are this prestigious. If I'd known, I, I would have gone for a better suit. Oh, wait, what? <clears throat> What's going on? Are you all right? But what? <sighs> Flashing. <sighs> Um, mother? Mother? Oh shit! Your hand! What? What? So? Okay, it's done. Excuse Did you me? put it in a safe place? Yes. I made sure no one was following me. Don't worry, Sarah. No one's going to find it. Find what? Are you absolutely sure? Yes, I'm sure. Right. Just one thing left to do. No, mother, no, don't, You're gonna don't. shoot her, aren't you? What? What? <laughs> Have you lost your mind? Cuckoo. There's no other way. If you, if you kill me, you won't find it. That is the point, my dear. No one must ever put their hands on it again. No, but I trusted you. No, Sarah! Don't! No! No! <gasps> you can run if you want to, Sarah, but you will pay for it. Damn. <sighs> you. Uh, Louis, are you alright? What's going on? Uh, I don't know what's going on, Duchess. Um. Here, take this. Oh, thank you. I'm sorry. Keep it. Yeah, yeah, I'm sorry. Are you better? 
No. I'm fine. Don't worry. No, we're not fine. What? It's getting late. Why don't why don't you go on ahead and I'll catch up with you, okay? Are you sure? Yes. I'm I'm sorry. Ooh, I'm sure now. yes. Okay. Fine. Mm -hmm. Okay, Duchess. We'll we'll catch up with you in a few minutes then. What the hell just happened? What? I definitely have to find mother quickly. Mother. <laughs> Am I going crazy or Oh, oh, what? This can't be real. The, the Duchess arrived with me. What's happening to me, for God's sake? I absolutely need to find you, Mother. Oh, we can run? Oh. There's Mother. Mother, are you up there, Mother? Or are you in some cave somewhere, like Sunny Boy suggests? We'll just, uh, just look in the road. There's nothing to look at here. Hey, what's this? Oh, wait. Oh, what? Louis, during the trip, I had something I wanted to ask you, but we didn't happen to run into each other. Yes, Duchess? I'm not sure if you remember, but we've met before. At that time, you were of two minds as to your choice of career. Tell me, what have you been up to since? Oh, my. Okay, what are we doing? Class, diplomat. She says <laughs> avoids faux pas. Well, that's no fun. <laughs> uh, the cultist. Mmm, that's interesting. The science and the arts, like using others to achieve his own ends, does not bother him. So he's like, mm, excels in investigation. Every detail and surroundings as well. The people who questions hands on doesn't shy away from direct approach. Yeah, we're gonna go detective. This looks very interesting, but um, I don't know. I'm gonna just I'm gonna go this way. See, there's multiple ways, so that means that there's multiple. Yeah, so we'll. Uh oh my, we have three points. Three what? Questioning, vigilance, logic, psychology, and agility skill. Seven effort points to use. Your past granted you one skill in manipulation. Your past granted one skill. Psychology. Oh, okay. So what's this? Conviction. Sheer force of your will and attitude. Oh wait, oh, okay, this is, oh yeah, right, okay, that's a cult, yeah, okay, so, uh, what are you doing? Oh, not oddly placed elements, yeah, okay. Logical mind and oratorical, oh, right, 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 right. Notice anything strange, so that's your brain, or a conversation, oh, I see. Dialogue and actions, dialogue and well, we're gonna go definitely one here. Well, we could do two or three, but no, I kinda wanna space them out a little bit. This is the brain one. Can we unlock this right now? Oh, we can too. Yeah, see. Can we get what, one more point? What's this? Coordination? Really? Hmm. Logical mind and oratorical talents. Behavior or appearance. Yeah, well, I think we'll go here. Okay, so we have no points. Can we. Well, we can't click over. What's this? Validate. Hold. Okay, we'll do this. Kablone. Well. Over the Inventory. last few years, I've solved a number of crime cases. Crime? Like the chauffeur d'Angers, for <laughs> example. Thieves that tortured crime. their victims yeah. with burning embers. Hmm, charming. Mm. 
How did you catch them? Very charming. I told the most cowardly one that the Burnt others flesh. had given them up. Ah, and I wager your thief suddenly started to talk. You blah, 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 he told blah, blah. us everything. The jobs, the stashes, the names of his partners. He's <laughs> couldn't like shut him up. I heard about that case, but I didn't know you were the one who solved it. I'm flattered that the news made it across the channel. And you've got a darn good memory, Duchess. Well, they say I have the memory of two people. Two people. But please, call me Emily. Fine, Emily. Uh, Tell me, uh, Emily. I was actually helped on that case by my mother. You wouldn't know her mm. by any chance. Wait, Louis. We've already. There should be a mother counter you up in do the corner. Me, don't you? What? Remember you? What? Where in the fuck did I remember you? In? Lie to her. What? And we don't have a liar. I don't remember you. Please excuse me, madam. I'm sure we've met before, but I don't remember where. Hmm. I appreciate your honesty, even if it's not very flattering for me. I imagine that with huh. your beauty, madam, huh, huh. it's the first time a man hasn't remembered your face. Well, I must say, you make up for yourself rather elegantly. Please stop torturing me. I'm completely at your mercy. Where have we met? Four years ago, in London? No. Sorry, I, I don't remember. In the office of William Pitt. Remember? No? Uh. <laughs> I'm so sorry, Emily, but I really don't remember you. William Let's Pitt. drop it, what? Louis. It doesn't matter. Right, time to go to the manor. I think those were codes. What? Oh, opportunities. Select objects more suggestive. Oh, your skills allow you to discover hidden details. Select objects that is more suggestive. Oh, okay. Um, wait, what? What? Now there's a timer? I ask her a question, she answers with another. Is she playing with me? Yeah, you, of course each person have their own personality. Vulnerable to certain skills. Immune to others. Right, right, right. Exhausted. What? No, no, no. But I am pushing that one. Oh, I have to do it after? Emily. Oh, look at this. Inventory. What do we got? Not a North Korea. And there's physio. Facial characteristics. That's the handkerchief she gave me. And that's Mortimer's invitation. Blah, blah, blah. Embarrassment. Yeah, well, I'm not going to be very happy when I get to talk to you, Mr. Mortimer. Everything was going smoothly until yesterday when your mother suddenly disappeared. Join me as soon as possible. Said you but what set some light on this mystery. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Lord Markworth. Farquart. Um who is this? English Duchess, close, close to the English crown. Yeah, okay. So fucking. <laughs> She's probably nobility. Regular visitor, accepted Gregory Holmes' invitation. She would miss one of these famed receptions. Yeah, okay. Oop. Oh, we have a map as well. And then uh, we don't know nothing about him. And she's uh, immunity to. Oh, really? Immunity to logic. What? <laughs> Do not understand, Captain. Uh, did it dis. Ooh. Caught in the ear of the Pope. Discreetly named him Cardinal. Really? Relationship to trust out. Pius the four, that's Pope Pi. He became Pope, did he not? More uh, <laughs> Oh, this is going to be a very, 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 very interesting game. One of two halves. Oh, I see. So it showed me her lips and her necklace, but I could only be one. 
asshole. Oh, master. Hmm. Jack of all trades. Yes, yes, that's what I am. So we'll definitely be going somewhere with that one. You can equip one extra manuscript. What? Royal Jelly cures negative alterations. Oh, temporarily reveals the immunities and bolder memories. Affecting a dialer. Oh, wow. What is this? Devil's Thorn. Well, we'll definitely need to hold on to that then. Okay, what's this? Carmelite water. Excuse my insisting, but you still haven't answered about my mother. Yeah. Do you know her? I was in You'll conversation. You'll see, Louis. Everybody here knows Sarah de Vichy. Uh, yeah, of course everybody knows mother. I don't know where we're going like this, Emily, but you're connected to my mother one way or another. And Somebody if I can believe my vision, one of these you days. don't have much of a place in her heart. Not a place in her heart. Remember to review and unlock condition and effects. They offer a very interesting. Okay. Uh, review all talents in the dedicated tab in the menu. Should we do this one? Yeah, so you have. Okay, so. Uh, who are you? Wait, oh yeah, there was this thing over here before I got so rudely interrupted in your conversation. Oh, oh, no, 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 no. Must be an incredible view from up there. What? Impossible to set foot on the island without being seen from 300 meters away. Yes, well, thank you for that, for that exposition. Can I look at this item now? What is this? I just pressed X. I didn't even know if that was the right thing. Royal Jelly restores two effort points. And I can't even anymore. And five. Oh. So Royal Jelly. Um, looks like I'm full on because that was diamond, correct? Yeah, see, that's the diamond. You should that's yeah, that's what this is in the bottom left. Effort I'm already full there. This is the one I was gonna look at. Oh, it's more than royal jelly. Jelly, jelly, jelly. Peanut butter jelly time. Peanut butter jelly time. Oh yeah, I can run. Running. Running. And more running. That's it. It doesn't waste any... Oh, oh, I can't go down there. It doesn't waste any stamina or anything. Just to run, run, run circles, run circles, run circles. Hey, oh, Good evening, sir. Hey, May hey. I ask your name, please? Louis Moras de Richet. Monsieur de Richet, delighted to welcome you among us, sir. You must be Sarah de Richet's son. I must tell you we are doing our utmost to find your mother as quickly as possible. Um, yeah, no, where's mother? What can you tell me about the disappearance of my mother? Two weeks have passed since Sir's mother went missing. Two All weeks. The staff here have since been busy searching every nook and cranny of. And the I'm just getting here now. But Sir may rest assured, we shouldn't be long in finding her. And just what have you found so far? It would seem that Sir's mother may be hiding on the island, and regularly changing her location. But no one seems to know why she would find this behavior necessary. What do you mean? On several occasions, we have found leftovers of food, a few of her things, or even traces of campsites. The reason why we are searching what, the what, what, what thing? is Where's because she... lights were spotted there last night. Where we are now? Indeed, sir. According to our information, lights were seen in the middle of the night, sir. After verification, none of the guests seemed to have left the manor last night. We think that perhaps sir's mother was here. higher your skill level, the lower the cost and effort points. Okay. Um, oh, there's a timer. Uh, 
Yeah, have you found anything here? And did you find anything then? We discovered a certain amount of damage, sir, on the wooden part of the wharf. What type of damage? Broken barrels, mainly. We'll do whatever is necessary to have them rapidly repaired. That's but not... quite frankly, I can't imagine what Sir's mother would have been doing with them. What could Mother have been doing with barrels? Nevertheless, our search of the wharf hasn't been entirely unsuccessful, though. What do you mean? We seem to have found an object that would appear to belong to Sir's mother. A handkerchief. Uh, uh, a handkerchief <laughs> is embroidered with the initials S.D.R. Well, maybe you should have gave me that to start with. That they are the initials of Sir's mother, Sarah de Richet. I have orders to give it to Lord Mortimer as soon as I see him. I know my mother. She's not the kind to go for a midnight stroll in the wharf for nothing. I've got to find out what the hell she was doing here. Where exactly did you find the handkerchief? On the landing dock, sir. The one you arrived by. Uh... Yeah, and I'll take it. I'll, uh, let me have the handkerchief. Give me the handkerchief. I'll personally show it to Lord Mortimer. Well... I've traveled hard for several days in order to get here. Yes, but invited by your master. Yeah, of course. But because my mother went missing right under your nose. Sir, uh -huh. please. And I... having only just arrived, you refused to give me her personal belongings? Of course not, sir. It was never my intention to contradict, sir. Here you are. I must return now. It is still much to prepare in order to welcome all the guests. Get it is up, on your here. handkerchief. Mother. Yeah, it is, Mother. You must have come here for a specific reason. I need to know what it is. Let's think. What could she have been doing out here on this wharf? There it is. See, I was here when he interrupted my conversation. Oh, that's creepy. Like, <laughs> let me tell you a story. One of blood. And oh, oh, look, yes, yes, yes. <laughs> oh, I want to be able to get both in the same. See, there's just things all over the place. See, we got, got the goat. Hello, goat. There's gonna, there's symbolism everywhere. Hey, what is this? Looks like a bar from an old gate. Bar? This miserable old bar has been broken fairly recently. The edges are still clean. And Take the it. tip is blackened. Without analysis to the contrary, I put my money on cannon powder. Uh, yeah, we're gonna... <laughs> now there's no timer. Yeah, we're taking the bar. This might just sure. come in handy. Uh-huh, uh-huh. Take it. Oh, that was a weird transition. What's this? A sack of seeds. It's you unopened. No one seems to have used any. You didn't see that when you came up here before. Now what what else have we missed then? Like what what was that all about? See? What? Some rope. Apparently no one's touched it for a good long time. Oh. Really? Okay, this is the boat we came in on. Those are all... Oh, oh my. Okay, we'll, we'll go back to that in a second. Because that looks important. That looks important. Lots. Hey, run. Okay, here we go. What's this? Really? Okay. Let's see what's hidden inside. Yes, let's see. Um, what? Find a clue. Send the letters one at a time. Let's see. look. Letters. What kind of letters? Carl Corey, are you what? Xavier. That sounds like a very important person. Well, they're all important people, but... It's too badly written. I, I oh, can't make oh. out the address. Never mind then. Who's next? Uh, Galbraith? The address is 50 Bedford Square, London. London? Mad Hill, uh, London. Um, idiot, what? It's hmm. good. 
A letter written in an oriental, oriental language. language. There we go. We don't know how to read the oriental idea what language. It says. Don't give me that crap. The S Silva Xavier. Who's this guy? The dressies in Sao Paulo, Brazil. Brazil. That reminds me. It's about time the order sent some envoys there. Order. Order the orders. Order the envoys. Uh, what's the other letter? Wow. Eminence Giovanni Brasci. Angelico Brasci. Giovanni Angelico Brasci. Ho even. Even ho. Who's this? Probably a Dutchman. Dutchman? Oh, okay. Dasho? Who? Oh, we don't know this guy then. Nope. Doesn't ring a bell. Doesn't ring a bell. Um, who's this one? An address in Cairo, Egypt. Egypt? Mortimer communicates with the whole world, apparently. Is that a minute? This envelope is meant for the Vatican. Oops. Better put that shit back. This name sounds familiar. Prashi. No. Can't seem to place it. Okay, that was everybody, right? Okay, let's go back to first letters. Um, we did that, right? Okay, so stand back. Oh, wait. There was another icon there. Let's first see what's time. hidden inside. Just wanted to go back. Okay, let's see. Find the clue. Ah, Try this. One of the letters is stamped with the seal of the order. And I recognize your handwriting anywhere, Mother. Mother. But who is this Samuel Ritter Doshua? Who are you writing to? I don't recognize the name. Let's see what's inside this letter. Oh, yeah. So. Just gonna read. Dear Samuel, Somebody my stay letter. on Lord Mortimer's <coughs> island is going wonderfully well. As I find myself in such charming company, I plan to stay a few more weeks. Would you be so kind as to send me a gift that I'd like to give to our old friend Manuel Godoy? I would be most grateful. I have been told that he's going to join us here soon. I would like to mark the occasion. Mark. Thank the you occasion. in advance. Okay. Yours devotedly, Sarah Faustine de Richer. Faustine. What is your game okay. here, Mother? Hmm. Secrets. Always more secrets. secrets you never talk to mother. anyone using language like this. Something's going on here. Who is this Samuel Ritter? And for crying out loud, who is this Manuel Godoy that you keep bringing up? Think. Why does the name sound so familiar? Oh, man. I'm guessing he's a man of some importance. Spanish, I'd say. But I just can't put a face to him. Well, hope we meet to talk about it soon, Mother. I don't know what you've gotten yourself into this time, but I'll bet you've got a lot to tell me. Tell me more, Mother. Oh. A lantern. Nothing special. All right, nothing special about a lantern. Okay. So now I'm gonna have to look at every single little thing, and hopefully not twice over. Depending. Oh, and see more items. I didn't see this before. Was this? It's like the barrel's been broken for quite some time. Broken. I can't do anything with it. Be up there watching a pair of binoculars or a telescope or uh, what, what was the thing? Um, surveyors use them. Yeah, I can't go. <laughs> uh, oh, what's this? Thing. Loot. Yeah, no, hey, you open the gate. You had a bar. Use it. Never get it open barehanded. Uh, use yes, use the bar. Clearly, I'm not much for manual labor. Let's see if I can get it open another way. Uh, excuse me. Yeah, we're gonna use to and just force it. There we are. 
use your muscles, your muscles. So then I can. Oh yeah, yeah. Okay, here we go. Uh, you press down. Oh, that was quick. Oh, that uses two. Okay. What 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 are we looking for? Came through the gate. That one, what? what? Oh, the water. What's this? Hmm. This wharf is used as storage for a lot of barrels. Wait, are those shackles? Uh huh. What have we here? It's cannon powder. Broken. It's unusable now. I don't know what the person who left this barrel like this had in mind, but it's a waste. Oh yeah, they're wasteful. They're what, what? There's shackles? Did they use the gunpowder to open the shackles? What? Oh, there is something there. What? Amber. You can pick up four of them. Increase your mask maximum effort points by one. Oh, wow. Amber crystals. How many did I just find? What? Where did I put them? Or is it just there? It's not in my inventory. What? Okay, there. What? Two items here? What's this one? Oh no, what's this one? Oh, more jelly. So then I have two. Use one more. There, now we're almost full again. We still have one in reserve. Oh, what's it? Step it out. I'm gonna look at pistol case. Hey. But it's empty. I don't know if this has anything to do with you, mother, but if it does. At least now you're armed. Why would that happen? Wait. Just like in my vision. Yeah, wait, yeah. None of it's telling me anything useful. Apparently, uh. someone on this island has gone through a whole lot of trouble to arm themselves. I really must find you, dear mother. And quickly, too. Dear mother. Quickly. Yeah, we're just searching the dock. We haven't set foot up the stairs to go towards the manor yet. We're investigating. Looking for stuff. See? Miss more stuff. What's this? A wooden floorboard. <laughs> yeah, sure looks like it. Probably comes from this part of the wharf. The wood is slightly eaten away, of course, but it still would have been fine if it weren't smashed. Mm, do we, oh, it doesn't cost anything? Vigilance level one. Judging by the splinters okay. of the wood, this floorboard has been ripped up. It was in decent condition. I wonder why someone ripped it up. What's the wonder. point of doing this? I wonder, wonder why. Judging by the splinters of the wood, oh, this okay. floorboard has been repeats. ripped up. But it was in decent condition. Okay. Never mind. I wonder why someone ripped it up. What's the point of doing this? Yeah, what's the point? What's the point? Probably comes from this part of the wharf. Okay, are we done? The wood is slightly eaten away, of course, but uh, excuse it me? still would have been fine if it weren't smashed. Ah, uh, step. Oops. Step back, step back. Hey, there's something not right about this floorboard. What? It's different from the rest. Just wait, 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 what? Oh, we didn't put a point into there. People. Well, we're gonna just try it anyway. Somebody's hiding something here. What's this? Somebody replaced it recently. It looks like it's fixed pretty solidly in place. It's going to be tough to rip it out of here. Yeah, let's try the rescue bar. The bar break open. Yes. That does it. Let's see what's hidden inside. 
Yes. There's a book and also a bag. The Mysterium Cosmographicum. I know that book well. Mother used to read passages from it to me all the time. And judging from what I can see, it's the same one as hers. For crying out loud, what's happened to you, Mother? Uh, where did we just put that? Manuscripts allow you to educate yourself. I'm using inventory, okay. Let's look inside the bag. A little food, a few toiletries, a small key, and some kind of black powder. Hmm. Shit, those are definitely my mother's things. Mm, definitely. I recognize her hairpins. This bag smells of her perfume. A piece of soap, some oils, and her powder puff. But what does all this mean? An iron key completely rusted. Why would she take... Oh, we're going to leave the key. Uh, I'd rather leave it all as it is. Maybe she put it here? Is the food some still fruit, good? A piece of bacon and some bread. The fruit's still firm. Okay, so it's fresh. The bread's a bit stale. Mm. <laughs> From the smell, this food's been here roughly two days. And if it's rationed, there's enough left to last two more days. Yeah, right, yeah, we're just that's enough. Out. I think I'd better leave her bag here. If she hid all this, it's because she thought she might need it later. Can so, put the board back, let's go through this. Okay. My mother's Good. been hiding pieces of bread between the rotten boards of the wharf in the middle of the night. Yep. That's not normal. Nope. And if that weren't enough, looks now like she's armed. Meanwhile, she also takes the time to send out letters, reassuring whoever might be interested that she's having a fabulous time here. So odd. So very odd. And that's not even all I've noticed. But maybe I ought to move on to the manor now. They'll be waiting for me. At least I hope so. <laughs> Good job. Go up to the manor. Oh, here we go. Latin inscription. And Nessis, mi fili quantilia produncia mundus vergatur. We don't know Latin. How did Mortimer manage to build his manor at the top of a rocky outcrop? Slaves. Oh, sorry, servants. Okay. size of this door this is a castle door what wow, wow. So, oh that's definitely Zeus Whoa. yeah <laughs> 1792 <laughs> what can I do for you your eminence. I wanted to ask you. You are the son of Sada de Vice, aren't you? Yes. You see, your mother yes. and I were supposed to meet here on this very spot. I was supposed to hand her a very important envelope. But I haven't mm -hmm. seen her. If only mother had told well, me you why can she was just coming. hand the envelope to me. Anyway, I will give it I to her. I ought to take the envelope. It might have something to do with her disappearance. Okay. Yeah, yeah, we're going to listen. That. If it will help, you can always give it to me. Yes, give me the letter. Several steps. Being as persuasive as possible. We are in confrontation of sequence. Oh, I have consequences on the rest of the story. Really? Not just on the conversation, but the whole story? Don't hesitate to use your skills. Oh, okay. 
Thank you, Let's my go. son. I'd bear that in mind. Three I'd that rather right? deal with her directly. Don't take it personally. Oh, I don't take Would it personally. you person. happen to know if your mother has arrived yet? Oh, she... 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 Oh, yes, yes, yes. She was here several weeks Certainly, ago. Certainly, your eminence. Mother got here some time ago. Yes. I was hoping yes, to find her did. when I arrived, but given the hour, she must be asleep by now. Right. I shall see her tomorrow, then. Mm -hmm. yeah. By the way, Your Eminence, I wasn't aware you knew my mother. Right, right, right. Ah, if you only knew my son, I hold your mother in the highest of regard. Oh, she do. has rendered great service to the church, and her help is invaluable. I hope that you will follow in her footsteps. Mm. If only she had told me where she was headed. Yes, yes. Nonetheless, our exchanges have always been discreet, and I should like them to remain as such. Oh, yeah, yeah, if your yeah, mother fine. wishes to speak to you about us one day, I will not mind if she does so. That is very commendable. But since we work together on a daily basis, it's, it's surely just an oversight. <laughs> yes, Most yes. certainly. Uh, you said you work together. What do you do exactly? What, what do I do? Oh, I'm a, I'm a very... Im yeah, I'm not gonna say that. What? Oh, it should be ours. Yeah. If you know my mother, you will understand that I cannot answer you, Your Eminence. I'm sorry, but... Do not worry, my son. I perfectly understand, and I expected nothing less from you. Discretion and secrecy oh, are both good. pillars of the organizations for which we work. You are uh, a worthy son of Sarah. What? All the same. It bothers me to see you in a quandary, Your Eminence. Is there any other solution? Look, if it's of any help, you can always leave your envelope with me, and I'll give it to her as soon as I see her. Uh, I uh, hesitate. Wait, Up till now, we have always palms? dealt with her in person, uh, and that has always been successful. Mm, do you think I should give it to you? Oh, that, that's entirely up to you, Mr. Priestman. Yeah, <laughs> you can turn on me. Uh, if I find her, no, no, no. Oh, in, oh, right. Depends on what it contains. Okay, we're gonna try it. This way. Only you know that, Your Eminence. Yeah. If you're asking me if you can trust me, or if I can keep a secret, I would oh. answer yes, absolutely. I understand. In truth, mm -hmm. it all depends on the nature of the contents of your letter. It is a list of names. This list must be of extreme importance. Ah, if only you knew. It's a list of people that your mother must help. Mm. Well, if she must Listen help them, my child. I can. If I give you the letter, can you promise me before God that no one other than your mother would read it? Oh, see, my mother will be the only one who will read it. Uh, yeah, what, yeah, what? Can you get the right one, or you have no blunders left? Oh. <laughs> um. Oh, yeah, yeah. Give me your... Promise me before... Oh, yes, yes. I swear by the You're almighty swear, God to swear. honor the promise that You're no not God right one there, but my right, mother so, right. cast swear her before gaze you. upon your letter. Yes. Good. <laughs> Listen, let's stop there. Easy. I'm going to tell you a secret. Really? Your mother and I are organizing the escape of a large number of French priests who face a massacre organized by the accursed Republican tribunals. The church is literally being bled like a beast. Without your mother, hundreds of men of the cloth would have gone to the guillotine. She has made the services of your order available to us by organizing the priests' safe passage across the borders. Even if she does not share all our convictions, she always provided assistance. Young man, you can be proud to be her son. Be it only for her sake. Always respect your name. Here, the letter Church I spoke of. Ching. It includes a list of about 15 names ready for departure. Be quick. Remember to tell Sarah when you see her. Be quick. That time is short. Quick like bunny. Well played. Oh, well, I'll decide been... later when I'm alone whether to look right. at what it contains. Look when I'm alone. It's already been two weeks since she went missing. So oh my god, hidden elements. Many clues and items are hidden. Some of them will have an impact on your adventure. So don't hesitate to look for them. 
Yay. Don't hesitate. I will not hesitate. So I'm not going over there yet then. Um, what's over here? Oh, hey, what's this? Devil's Thorn grants you exalted state. Temporarily sees the immunities and vulnerabilities affecting dialogue. Oh. Devil's Thorn. I'll keep it. Oh, uh, yeah. We'll keep that. I'm assuming I can't go upstairs. And maybe I should introduce myself to the other guests first. Mm, yes, yes. Introduction. Whoa, this is, uh... Blind Oedipus. Blinded oh. himself. What a tragic destiny. Um... The Thaw? Really? Fall of the Damned by Rubens. The man who cannot achieve the salvation of God the Father is offered to fall into the depths of the abyss. Where he thrives in his king. What are they talking about? I can't quit. <laughs> you can't quit here. Uh, blind. Run, 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 run. Hey, what's this one? What? Oh, that, that was our door. That's how we got in here. Oh, what? What? Saturn devouring his son. Oh. God, how awful. Everything in this painting is disturbing. It's the first time I've seen brushstrokes like this. I think that's the first time I've seen that painting. Like, I've seen uh, Oedipus and the, the Fall before, but I don't... Ever. What? Saturn devouring his son. Good God, how awful. Oh. Everything in this painting is disturbing. It's the first time I've seen brushstrokes like this. Mm. Oh my, this, this, this guy Crucifixion has. of St. Peter. He was crucified upside down out of humility. Yep. Surprising for an entrance hall. Surprising. Yeah, that's probably not an original though, right? Like the Crucifixion of Saint Peter. There's no way that's an He was crucified upside down what? out of humility. Well, Surprising no for an entrance hall. Any of these can be originals. They should be in a museum. Oh. That's definitely Zeus. Definitely Zeus. Okay, well, we've been rolling for just about an hour. That was a whole lot of exposition. I don't know who that guy is. <laughs> My goodness. What a architectural beauty. Yeah, that's for all oh, here. Let's do this door. Can we get through here? No, it's locked. That means we have to go talk to people. So we'll use one more set of those. And just before we go, we go in there, we will use the juice. Yeah, that's just, just the creepiest, creepiest thing ever. <laughs> yep. Okay, well, thank you very much. I think we're gonna continue with this because they are. There's symbolism everywhere. I think this is gonna be a fun, fun conversation game. Who else is over there? Oh, the priest is over sitting down. Okay. Here's a book. Oh. What were you talking about? Yeah. Sir. I 
got something in my ear, sir. Can you help me out, sir? <laughs> got his finger in my ear. <laughs> so anyways, yeah, thank you very much. We will uh, probably continue with this game for sure.